We don't need a fan. We don't need a heater. All we need is this pretty day here. Don't need an air conditioner. The wind and the leaves. Whispering. The wind and the leaves. Playing our tune. Look at that. Playing us a tune. That's all we need. Not burning any electricity. There we go. What's the temperature? 80, 82. Just find you a little shade, Jay. Don't need to go anywhere. Wow, look at that. I cut those the other day. Got bunches of them. This is one of those days in the fall. Look at that. Now the wind is getting up a little bit. Our garbage man is late. It was supposed to have been here Friday. That's where I got those uh, little things right there. <laughs> they were in the power line right there. So I cut them back. But our garbage is getting piled up because they cut out the... Uh, they just have one man truck, one of these modern Monday one man trucks. And they can't keep anybody to drive it because uh, it's so hectic trying to line the, line the truck up with a garbage can backwards and forwards. But when they used to have a man, they never they were always on time and always finished. They always got the garbage, but now they can't find anybody that can do it. I don't blame them. I couldn't do it either. I'd, be, I'd have to quit the first day. Cause, uh, and they probably wear out clutches trying to line the truck up just right to get the uh, can. When, he, when they had a man back there, they'd just pull up and the, and the man, but uh, uh, hop off and uh, put set a couple of cans on the back. It didn't take any time. But they were trying to eliminate a man, a job. Probably spent millions and millions of dollars trying to eliminate it. I don't know how many clutches they wear out on the truck trying to uh, 
line up. In other words, they have to pull up. See on that, they have to pull up and then dump that one at a time and then go right on. All that to try to eliminate a job. They'll spend a million dollars to save a nickel. Well, I'm not going to complain. But somewhere up high, I don't blame them. I, I tell you, I don't blame the truck drivers. I don't blame the garbage people because they just do as many uh, cans as they can do. And as, much, as much as they can do. And then at the end of the day, they go home. Whereas in, before, they were finishing the whole job and then going home. All in on, I'm going about garbage. Well, that's the way I read it. In fact, I, I'm real nice to the garbage man. I don't blame him. I blame those in high places that think they uh, they never had to do it. <laughs> Can you imagine one day uh, trying to get your truck lined up over the, over the garbage can and it only emptying one at a time or he raises it up and throws it in but then they have to do that over and over and over again and it's a uh, hectic on, on just a driver they don't have a spare man I pay another man they went so long one time they uh <laughs> they went so long one time they had to had to bring up uh, get the old truck out and uh Put some people on the back to come get it. That's the only beef I have today is that uh, the technology is a uh, is a uh, trying to save a job. They uh, they laid on the garbage. I think they ought to go back to the old truck and put a man back there. And then they, they could just pull up. They turn around in my driveway. I just say, yeah, sure, you can turn around in my driveway, sure. That's fine with me. They just come up there and park, and then the man on the uh, outside does it all. And the driver can rest his neck and his nerves. Instead of being in a frantic race to get through the day and then not finishing all the work because somebody up in high places hadn't figured on the wear and tear on the truck, which is probably in the shop right now getting fixed <laughs> from all the, the uh, backing up and going for FCC. Every time they come up, every time they get one, they have to line the truck up and uh, to grab the, the can. It sounds like a good thing, but it's not. It's something a man can do. Nothing wrong with being a trash man. Garbage man. Nothing wrong with that. I'd do it if I need something to eat. In fact, I do it right now all the time. <laughs> I do it right now all the time. I do it at, at a, at a uh, when these dogs get in this garbage out here that, 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 uh, that they didn't pick up. I get out here and rake it up and put it back in the can. So I do, uh, in fact, I do it for my neighbors down there too. I got up there the other day, put it in my trash can. Cause uh, the, uh, the uh, somebody in high places uh, thought it's real good to have a one man truck. Not so, but it's just this. That's about like the electric car. <laughs> not gonna be, not gonna be. There goes my neighbors there. We, be, we live at the end of a dirt road. Well, kind of a little gravel on it, but it's a dirt road. Those came out of the top of that tree right there. I'm gonna get the rest of them pretty soon.
Uh, all of a sudden. Uh, we'll use it for something. This will be good to run beans with in a garden. Anyway, just want to show you this day and, uh, and uh, moan a little bit about the uh, garbage this late and give you my uh, opinion on what would be the best thing to do. I say get the old garbage truck back and let the hire you another fella back there and give him a job. and get the garbage on time. That's what you do. They sure want you to pay them on time. Anyway, I'm on to the, this, this, uh, this old boy down here in Alabama. Peace and love to you anyway. <laughs> Things gonna be all right. Everything's gonna be all right, the garbage too.